Tesla's billion-dollar investment in two revolutionary battery technologies has just been leaked, and it is sending seismic waves through the automotive and energy industries. Overnight, Tesla's experiments with aluminum ion and sodium ion batteries have forced major manufacturers across China, Korea, Europe, and the United States to reconsider their own battery strategies. Tesla's stock surged 16.7%, coming within just 10% of its all-time high, signaling to investors that this is not just another incremental development. It is a transformation of what electric vehicles can achieve. Elon Musk may still be keeping certain details under wraps, but the leaked information we have paints a clear picture of a company preparing to redefine the economics, performance, and global reach of electric mobility. Aluminum ion batteries have long been viewed as the future of high performance EVs. Historically, the challenge was low energy density compared to lithium ion batteries. Early aluminum ion packs achieved only around 220 watt hours per kilogram translating into approximately 250 to 300 miles per charge, significantly less than what gasoline cars could achieve with a single tank. Because of this limitation, skepticism about aluminum ion technology was widespread, even among EV enthusiasts and early adopters. However, Tesla's latest tests from Q3 2025 indicate a 45% increase in energy density, which completely redefines the potential of aluminum ion batteries. The technological breakthrough is rooted in advanced cell architecture, stacking technology, and material optimization. Tesla has developed a 3D honeycomb stacking design that allows cells to be 80% thinner, shrinking from 50 nanometers to just 10 nanometers. This interlaced stack reduces empty space between cells from 5 microns to under 800 nanometers, cutting wasted volume by 84%. As a result, Tesla can now fit five times more cells into the same battery pack without increasing weight or size. This is not just an incremental improvement, it fundamentally changes the energy storage capacity within the same physical footprint. A critical innovation is the application of a 0.5 micron nanopolymer coating on the graphene anode. Raw graphene previously stored ions only in select areas, leaving large portions of the surface unused. The nanopolymer coating distributes ions evenly, improving cathode efficiency from 65% to 95%, effectively allowing each battery to store 1.5 times more energy. Combined with the honeycomb stacking design, Tesla's aluminum ion battery now reaches 320 watt-hours per kilogram. When integrated into a 75 kilowatt-hour pack, this translates to up to 450 miles of range on a single charge surpassing competitors like the Tesla Model Y Long Range at 330 miles, Ford Mustang Mach-E at 320 miles, and Rivian R1T at 410 miles. Imagine being able to drive from New York to Washington, D.C., without stopping once to recharge. For long-distance drivers and road trip enthusiasts, this is a game-changing development. If that excites you, comment, Aluminum Ion 450 miles below. But range isn't the only benefit. Aluminum ion batteries offer ultra fast charging, achieving 100% charge in just 8 minutes, along with exceptional safety with zero fire risk. They also provide lifespan three times longer than traditional lithium ion batteries, retaining 89% of capacity even after 2.5 million miles. This longevity makes aluminum ion batteries ideal for high mileage fleet vehicles performance EVs and long-distance transport applications. Shifting focus to sodium-ion batteries which are poised to become the world's cheapest and most scalable EV battery solution, the numbers are staggering. Analysts initially estimated Tesla's sodium-ion production costs at $30 per kilowatt-hour, already nearly three times cheaper than lithium-ion at $90 per kilowatt-hour. Recent reports indicate Tesla has pushed costs even lower, potentially to $11 per kilowatt hour. This means a 75 kilowatt hour pack could cost just $1,200, compared to roughly $11,400 for a lithium ion pack, creating a tenfold cost advantage. Tesla intends to pass these savings directly to customers, which could dramatically expand EV accessibility worldwide. Tesla achieved this cost reduction by transitioning from sodium sourced from natural salt mines, costing $500 per ton, 
to recycled sodium extracted from industrial glass and chemical production byproducts, costing only $150 per ton. Additionally, Gigafactory Shanghai has implemented a low-temperature extraction process to replace the traditional high-temperature 800 degrees Celsius kills, which consumed 50 kilowatt-hours per ton of sodium. Using an organometallic chemical catalyst, sodium can now be extracted at just 200 degrees Celsius with only 15 kilowatt-hours per ton, reducing refining costs by 70% and significantly decreasing the environmental impact. While sodium ion batteries were once considered non-competitive due to low energy density, 120 to 160 watt hours per kilogram, Tesla's electrode stacking technology, similar to the aluminum ion approach, allows sodium ion to reach 275 watt hours per kilogram. This surpasses BYD's blade battery at 165 watt hours per kilogram, which is widely used in European and Asian EVs. Sodium ion batteries also demonstrate remarkable durability, supporting up to 15,000 charge cycles, five times longer than lithium ion. Even in extreme temperatures like minus 30 degrees Celsius, they retain 90% of their capacity compared to lithium ion batteries, which typically lose 40% under similar conditions. This combination of low cost, high durability, and acceptable energy density positions sodium ion batteries as a game changer for affordability focused EV models. Tesla is now poised to dominate both ends of the market aluminum ion for premium high performance vehicles and sodium ion for low cost mass market vehicles. Competitors, including BYD, Panasonic, CATL, Ford, and Rivian, now face a significant challenge in keeping pace. How will these batteries be deployed? Current Tesla models such as the Model 3 and Model Y are unlikely to adopt aluminum or sodium ion batteries in the immediate term. Instead, Tesla plans to roll out these batteries in new vehicle models. Sodium ion is expected in the Tesla RoboVan, designed for early 2027 deployment. Its low cost, high load capacity, and stability in extreme temperatures make it ideal for continuous urban delivery operations. Aluminum ion is optimized for the Tesla Semi, which requires both high energy density and extended range. The earliest consumer-facing application will likely be the 2026 Model 2, offering two versions, aluminum ion for high-performance variants and sodium ion for ultra-affordable base models. Production readiness will dictate launch timing. Q3 2025 tests suggest aluminum batteries could enter mass production within 10 to 12 months with initial output of 80 GWh per year at Gigafactories Nevada and Texas. Tesla is collaborating with Redwood Materials to scale aluminum recycling, reducing energy consumption by up to 95% and lowering raw material costs by 40%, from $60 per kilowatt-hour to $36 per kilowatt-hour. Aluminum battery packs for the Model 2 could therefore cost $2,200 to $2,400, resulting in a final vehicle price of approximately $19,000 for the performance variant, with an initial production run of 300,000 units. Meanwhile, sodium ion production at Gigafactory Shanghai could be ready in four to six months, with mass production transitioning to Gigafactory Texas in December 2025, producing 100 GWh annually. The Model 2 sodium ion variant is expected to be priced under $17,000, targeting the low-cost segment in the U.S. and Asia, with an initial batch of 500,000 vehicles in Q2 2026. Both battery types reduce reliance on scarce minerals, increase supply chain resilience, and reduce exposure to geopolitical risks. Combined with Tesla's ultra-fast chassis assembly lines, which can assemble a car frame every five seconds, Model 2 deliveries could be reduced from months to just a few weeks. Beyond production, these batteries are set to reshape the global EV industry. Aluminum ion targets performance enthusiasts and premium models, while sodium ion opens the market to millions of new EV buyers. Together, they position Tesla to dominate both high-performance and cost-conscious segments, creating a competitive moat that few other manufacturers can penetrate. Tesla's innovations extend to sustainability as well. Aluminum recycling, low-temperature sodium extraction, 
and lower energy consumption during battery production all contribute to Tesla's environmental goals. These processes reduce emissions, conserve natural resources, and make EVs more accessible globally. For consumers, the benefits are profound. Imagine an affordable EV with 450 miles of range, 8-minute charging, and 15,000 cycle longevity, all priced under $20,000. Imagine fleets operating vans capable of years-long service without battery replacements, functioning efficiently even in extreme climates. Tesla is moving beyond merely making cars. They are redefining transportation economics for the 21st century. Competitors now face a difficult landscape. BYD, Panasonic, CATL, Ford, and Rivian may have strong positions in the EV battery market. But Tesla's combination of cost, performance, durability, and scale is unprecedented. Even companies heavily invested in EVs will struggle to match Tesla's advancements in battery chemistry, mass production, and supply chain efficiency. Looking forward, Elon Musk's strategy is clear. Prioritize material science breakthroughs, scalable production, cost efficiency, and customer benefits. Tesla is not just building cars. They are building an ecosystem in which their batteries set the global standard. By controlling both the chemistry and production process at scale, Tesla minimizes reliance on external suppliers and creates formidable barriers for competitors. The impact of Tesla's aluminum ion and sodium ion batteries goes beyond technology, it has global implications. Cheaper, safer, longer lasting, and higher performing batteries can accelerate EV adoption worldwide reduce emissions, and improve energy efficiency. Aluminum ion provides high performance, while sodium ion provides affordability, creating a dual market strategy that few companies can replicate. If you're excited about the future of Tesla and EVs, comment below. Which battery excites you more? Aluminum ion for high performance or sodium ion for affordability? And if the 2026 Model 2 launches with both options, would you be ready to purchase one? Like, share, and comment if this breakdown was helpful. Thanks for watching Torque Element, and we'll see you in the next video.